the choreographed fingers of Sophie Fellows dance along the strings of her violin with a grace and confidence that is matched only by her 10-year-old smile. Well, I have butterflies in my stomach. Sophie joins 17 of her colleagues from their Vermont Violin School for a special holiday performance at Boston Children's. It was this time last year Sophie also performed at Children's, one day before surgery to remove a large tumor on her brain. It's pretty phenomenal to see, and I'm so uh, glad that she's been able to play. Front and center today, mom Amy and dad Chad, beaming with pride as only parents can, acknowledging the importance of this 30-minute long performance, fully aware the risk their daughter faced after her 15-hour surgery. She's back in school on grade level. She's, you know, just functioning really well. Sophie's doctor, Liliana Gomnarova, had been hopeful for this outcome, but knew it wasn't a guarantee. Any time you undergo brain surgery, there's always the possibility that you could have some kind of neurologic or brain damage. Sophie still has some eye problems and issues with balance, small side effects with which her parents say they're still dealing. But a year later, and things are about as good as they can get. I feel great. I'm, I, I don't feel sick at all. And for one more time, doctor and patient were side by side, performing Pachelbel's Canon. Grace and confidence, a 10-year-old who was well on her way to an amazing encore. That was so fun. <laughs> In Boston, Reed Lamberty, WCVB, New Center 5.